Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this exhibition matchup. A lot in store here for you tonight as we're going to have a hotly contested matchup between the new CTO Global Champion Malachi as he will face off against one of the Indigo Children's own in seven. But I am your commentator, Norman Rhodes. I'm going to bring you along the action here. But as you can see right there, global champion in the ring, Malachi, making his way out here first. This is a non-title match, so of course, champion making his presence known first in this instance. Of course, if this was championship match and he's coming out first, there's something wrong with the order here. But thankfully, it's not that case. As you see, Malachi just... Appealing to the crowd there as he got in the ring and everything and now waiting his opponent you gotta and so There's seven. As I was just saying, he was awaiting his opponent in seven. There he is right there. Get interrupted by that little whatever the heck that was. That just interrupted me. But like I said before, as you saw, a part of the Indigo Children. You know, that currently houses, of course, Scarlet, Christopher Scarlet, the man who at one point was undefeated, was 10 and 0, and then the man who brought, put the one in 10 and, and 1, in this case, being Malachi. But of course, it's not about undefeated streaks, it's not about being an underdog, it's not about being the indomitable fighter, it's about one on one action between the new champion, who, by the way, Malachi, oh my god, just thrown! Off that second rope by seven and seven went for that beautiful knee there, but missed. Or I'm sorry, it was countered. And now you see these two just strike it back and forth. That's a slap, baby. That was a slap. And you see the headbutt from seven, and now the punch from Malachi. Another open hand punch right there. <clears throat> another slap, another one. Continuously slapping seven here. And clubbing him. That overhand punch and staggering him into the ropes. Coming off now, ducking under, seven off the ropes himself, Big Lariat taking out the new champion. Malachi winning that CTO Global Championship from the likes of Danny Harris and Logan Drew. Logan Drew, the current Impulse Champion in NAH. And as you can see, Malachi back on the offensive here with the leapfrog there and one more leapfrog over seven. And there's a Japanese arm drag taking down seven. Now you gotta think that every member of the Indigo Children holds some type of grudge with Malachi here, especially being that their leader and Christopher Scarlet was defeated by this very man, the current global champion. As we saw him do a beautiful, a beautiful uh, Hurricane Rana there and taken down after giving chase. After Malachi gave chase there, and look at that. Asserting his dominance in this matchup at the moment. Looked like his foot was right on the jaw of Malachi. And oh my goodness. You just see the head bouncing off the mat there. Going for the cover here. Two. And Malachi grabbing the bottom rope, breaking the count at two. Malachi up and oh god, a... Big backbreaker right there on the Malachi. As we're now into a beautiful rest hold that chin lock by seven as he is slowing this pace down a little bit more than usual. I've seen Malachi go fast, I've seen him go slow. And seven continuing those backbreakers here, hoping to get a three count. Two and no. Malachi 
once again kicking out. No, look at that. Tints up the back. Absorb that kick. Tells him to bring it. Seven. Face front face locks him and delivers that knee. One more time, he says. There's a headbutt. Malachi really wants him to bring it here, and Seven is going to continue to as he's going right into the combination. He's here. Jesus Christ, those punches and punches, taking him down into the corner. Now going to work here, stomping away at Malachi. He wonder here, implications for the CTO Global Championship as he kicks out at two. If seven would have gotten three right there at any point during this matchup. Seven has him on the ropes though. Off the ropes and big elbow! Shit, what? Popped right back up afterwards. Going to town here on seven. It's almost like he absorbed that elbow just to, to kick back up here. Drop kick in the corner. Malachi on fire. There's another drop kick in the other corner. And oh my goodness, there's a beautiful arm bar. Locked in on seven. This could be the arm breaking moment for Malachi as he is looking to get a submission here. But will seven tap out? Seven. Still locked in this hole, has to hold on here if he wants this match to continue, and he does. As Malachi has no other choice but to break that. Oh, wait a second here. Death Valley Driver. Slam right there. Two with the leg hooked. No, so close to a three count right there and a possible future global championship shot. I'm sure Malachi understands that if anyone gets the one up on him, that shows a bit of weakness. He cannot show weakness as the newly crowned that underhook DDT. One, two, and no. I'm sorry, a double underhook inverted DDT. Uh, you can call it whatever you want, face plant. Another coaches, an unprettier, if you want to call it that. But Malachi back on the offense here. Oh, I thought he was going to go off the ropes there. Oh, now he does after celebrating a bit. And oh, my. Right over the top rope. Malachi looking to fly here. Oh, my God. What a tope. So is Cena. Or you could call that a placha, either one. Hm. Either terminology, I think, in this moment is fine, but you see Malachi on the apron there. Might be signaling to go to the top rope here. Wasting too much time. Could be given, and just as I thought, giving Seven enough time to gain his bearings. Meet him right on that top rope there. And oh, look at that. Seven's going to take advantage here with that top rope. Job breaker. And the referee wants to check on Malachi. Make sure he can still continue in this matchup. And look at that kick to him while he's down. And oh, look at that. Once again, putting that boot right on the jaw of Malachi. Picks him up. Takes him right over to the ropes here, and oh, beautiful overhead, belly to belly. Hooks that leg, two, and no. Malachi, with every ounce of his being, able to kick out there the last possible second. Seven that, please, picks him back up. And now we're putting him right back into the corner here. A little celebration there was on, and oh my, what a head, what a beautiful bulldog. Almost had a headbutt for some reason. What, what in the world is going on with my terminology? Going up top here, and oh, with that double stomp. And oh, Malachi will barrel arm drag off the ropes. 
Uh oh, what is this? Oh, head scissors! Taking him down! Almost like a leg slap me there. Malachi wants him to get up. Looking for an attack. This time from the top rope. Thought it was going to be from the apron. Oh, arm drag right there from Malachi. Going for the pin immediately here. One, two, and no. Seven kicks out. And now you see Malachi going to work with those elbows right to the look like right to the, the collarbone but that's continuing the arm work here for Malachi oh my god that was something else chanted there by the fans and oh just stomped right on the hand the left hand of seven you know his his signature the the oh Hey, I know this. That double wrist clutch into the pin. Two and no. Oh. That double wrist clutch lever that leads right into a pin if you want it to. Move I'm very familiar with. Goes by another name on the mind, but it doesn't matter. Oh, it's a Gary block. Seven has a mom. Oh God, what a tiger. Tiger bomb. Two. And a kick out by Malachi. Malachi sent into the corner. Seven follows with that. Looks like a knee right in the corner. Now going up top after he threw him aside. Oh, and a double stomp. Or as Scarlett calls it a God's whisper. Two and no! Malachi survives yet again. And look at this. Seven. Seven is looking dangerous here. Seven is. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, this could be dangerous. Oh God! Seven just power bomb Malachi right up to the edge of the ring. The referee has started his count here. Oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. This, this is over. This is over for Malachi. There is no way. Wait, wait, what? He is actually. He's actually getting up here. He's actually getting up here. Oh my God! There's Eric Rivera, but the referee didn't see it because he's busy with he's trying to keep seven from going outside here. And Rivera is just, I know he has to hear those chair shots. He has to. And oh God! Super kick right to Malachi. As we get the referee is just busy. Busy with, with seven in the ring. I cannot believe what I just seen. You know, over the past months, we've seen Eric Rivera and Cassius attack Malachi here, and there's the cannon plex. After the after the melee of chair shots. Two Unbelievable. Of course, Seven is going to pick up this victory. Rivera coming in, dealing some extra damage. A man that if... Oh, oh, wait a second. He's not done. This is not done yet. Fighting back here, Malachi. I was just talking about that. There's Rivera, and there is Cassius. And once again, the beatdown. Oh, Malachi. And if Malachi wants to, to face Rivera again, he has to put his career on the line. And oh, God, what a right hand. My God.